Hello once again, and greetings from Japan. Today is May the 24th, and today we have a 2005 December Toyota Alphard MNH10. That's the three liter, two wheel drive, with 30,000 miles, uh, which translates to 48,000 kilometers. It has a full service history. The last servicing was only six months ago. So the car is in very nice condition. Okay, so let's take a look at it. It's um, the usual front fog lights. It's got sonar uh, parking sensors all around. It's got very nice aftermarket 18 inch wheels with good radial tires. They're all as nice as this one uh, in very nice condition. It has the uh, winker mirrors and the usual window visors. It's in black and 209 color. Uh, it's very nice. It was actually graded 3.5 in a CAA auction, but um, it's positively grade four car, as you will see from the video, and also when you take a look at the 60 odd photographs in the Dropbox link, you'll see the condition is just very clean. The body is really clean. Standard muffler, and it has um, keyless entry on the rear door and the driver door. And the uh, sorry for the uh, tank, the Norfolk Terrier, giving us a anyway a recital of his barking. He's, um, he gets annoyed by the crows. Okay, it's got a power rear gate, which works on one of these rods, sorry, there we go, is it this one? So there's a lot of remotes, oh, oh yeah, of course it's locked, you have to unlock it first, sorry. <laughs> okay, power rear gate, it's got uh, power slide doors as well, of course. This car has practically every option, and I'll describe them all as we go around. It's a very nice interior. It's really well taken care of. There's also a dealer option uh, mat that uh, covers the luggage area as well. It's got the optional chrome strip and protects the top of the rear bumper. And okay, let's close the gate. You can either close it from the remote, or there's a button on the um, on the uh, actual door. Okay, lock it again. There again, nice straight corner. It's really nice when they come in with no scratches on the bumper. It's not too common, even on grade four point five. It's really nice condition. Okay, full tint, full tinted windows all around. This one is the MXZ, but this one has full factory kit. It has the side kit. So it's just nice looking when they've Got a little bit of aero on them, and especially with 18-inch uh, wheels, really offsets the car. And of course, it has twin sunroofs as well. HID and AFS headlights. You might notice a couple of raindrops on the car. It's kind of spitting. A little bit. You can 
see the condition of the front lip. This is the dealer option front lip it has. And the chrome grill. Absolutely no fading or anything. Okay. So, as I say, it's got keyless entry on the driver door and the rear and the rear gate. So if the key is in your pocket, there's nothing you need to do. It comes with a complete set of keys, uh, two remotes, a spare, and these other remotes that um, operate the, the rear gate. I'm oh, sorry, the rear gate, and uh, also has a remote engine starter for those cold mornings when you want to get in the car with the heater already blasting away, or vice versa in the in the summer when uh, you want the air conditioning already cooling the car. That's a neat little option. Okay, in we get. So, so the key and ignition on. You can see it's got 48,000 kilometers, which translates to 30,000 miles. And as mentioned, the last service was only 6,000 kilometers ago. Uh, six, six months ago, sorry. And, okay, there's a rear camera. I think that's only has a rear camera on this one. And there's the service records. And this one, this is the last one, there's other ones in here. And the date on it is uh, 2010 December, December the 19th. So anyway, there we go. so it's well taken care of. The lid is good, not loose for anything. There's a lock nut bolt for the alloys. Um, front headlining. It's all good. And as mentioned, it's got twin roofs, twin sunroofs, which are controlled right here. It also has power curtains. So everything works. I'm not going to operate the curtains, but they all work. They're all electric, they're all powered. So they're all tied back right now, so they wouldn't close anyway. But they all work. It has a flip down monitor and it has the remote for the flip down monitor which will be sent of course separately. The glove box will be sent with the paperwork and it's a non-smoker car which is always really nice. Another glove box, cup holder and the rear cup holder in perfect condition. Has a switch now, I'm not sure what that is. Maybe some kind of LED lighting. And it has cruise control. And it also has various controls here. The, um, the rear power door here. The, it has traction control. It has lane departure warning and it has suspension options, sports or comfort suspension. So you can choose what kinds you want. Oh, sorry, it does have, sorry, it does have other cameras here, sorry. It has uh, front cameras as well. Okay, here we go. Pretty much everything on this car. And theater sound. So it has <coughs> the optional speakers in the roof as well. 
and treat the speakers in the pillars. And here it has more controls for the AFS if you want to turn that off or the power doors. Controlling the uh, slide doors on the driver seat. Anything else? No. Very clean steering wheel, typical of the mileage. I'm not sure if this is a one owner car, but I would assume it is. Quite often the auction sheets, the, the auctions don't say it. Sometimes you can figure it out from the paperwork. I don't know if we did. Anyway, it certainly looks like it. Okay. That's it for inside. Let's just try the. Oh, also power driver seat. And then we just forget that. And the driver seat is just really nice. It's beige, but it's a, it's a heavy duty, a very heavy duty cloth. And uh, it's um, in very nice condition. No wear at all on the piping. And the driver mat also. And the steps all have the little optional carpets. Kind of a nice touch, but whatever. So you can lock that. From here you just uh, press the button, but let's try the slide doors. It's a seven-seater car, um, so it's second seats are two seats and then three in the back, so seven all together. As mentioned, for a more detailed view, you can view the Dropbox photographs at your leisure. Is, they show everything pretty much. Oh yeah, it's got uh, Isofix seats in, in the middle. This is supposed to move. Oh, it's very heavy. And it's in. Excuse me, that's. And you need two hands for that. Okay, here's the rear. Just. Nice unmarked interior, no stains at all. Don't think anybody's been drinking Coca Cola in here, thank God. Anyway, with a flip down monitor in the back as well, and full curtains as you can see, curtains all around. Okay, let's close the doors. And we need to take a little peek at the engine. I'm always trying to think what I forgot to say, but anyway, whatever. Take a look at the engine. So, okay. Here we go. Ah. Again, very clean. The VVTI three liter V six engine with thirty thousand miles on the clock. So the car hasn't had a lot of use in its uh, time on the road. Just a really nice looking example. Let's take a look at the auction sheet. So, it 
It's a Heisei 17, which translates to 2005, December, 48,600, I think it's 700 now, we've driven it, uh, um, maybe 30, 30 kilometers, and can't find anything wrong with it, that's 30,000 miles, uh, so it was a grade 3.5 in the CA auction. I think the reason was that when it came in, it had a couple of carrier dents on the roof. People put carriers on, and sometimes you get these dents. Anyway, they were removed. They were removed by a professional uh, dent remover. Um, besides that, um, the car is just very clean, as you can see from the video and the photos. And it has just all the options. It, uh, it did originally have standard 17-inch wheels. We've changed the wheels. And um, just says power driver seat, back monitor, front camera, uh, you know, all the rest of it. That's everything I just mentioned. So, yeah, nice, proper, clean car. Looking for a new owner. Did I forget anything? <coughs> Maybe. Anyway, just to reiterate, 2005, December, with 30,000 miles, fully serviced, last service being six months ago. Um, the MZ, but it's got the full kit and 18-inch wheels, and pretty much full options. Anyway, I hope somebody likes it, and... Uh, Thank you for watching yet again, and bye for now.
We are a UK based personal car import agent trading since 2004. We have a proven track record supplying thousands of Japanese cars direct from Japan to customers throughout the UK. Working as your appointed agent for a fixed commission, we provide a four step personal car import service. This is an opportunity to cherry pick and safely buy the best high grade, low mileage cars direct from Japanese car auctions at export trade prices for personal import to the UK. You will make large savings on UK retail prices while buying the best quality cars available in Japan. It's a genuine win win opportunity. Before the auction starts, background checks and hands on inspection are carried out by the Japanese staff. Under Japanese law, any accident history or mileage discrepancy must be declared by the auction and shown on the auction report. The truth is, the best cars normally stay in Japan. They are bought by Japanese dealers for resale because the best cars will pass a strict Japanese roadworthy test, known as a shaken. Shaken failures are seen in Japan as fits for recycle or export. Many turn up in the UK without the auction port to maximize the dealer's profit margins. So it's vital to see a genuine translation of the auction report before the sale starts. Once we have found a particular car, we next arrange our hands on inspection to confirm the condition matches the auction report and take a large number of photos. Keep in mind we are not car dealers buying and selling for profit. Why supply bad cars? When it's just as easy to supply a great car from the fountain of supply and simply keep adding to our long established superb track record. Check out our customer reviews or head to our YouTube channel found on our website to see the quality of the cars we supply. To learn more, pick up the phone and speak to us direct without obligation. Ask for Paul. Telephone 01625 560 505 or mobile 07989 560 505. Our email sales at japautoagent.com. <laughs>